I have a breaking news. A 50 years old Soviet spacecraft is hurtling back to Earth at 17,000 meters per hour. And no one knows where it will land. It could be your city. Stay tuned to find out the shocking details. It was launched in 1972 during the height of the Cold War. Cosmos 482 was a Soviet mission invented to explore Venus. However, a malfunction left it stranded in Earth's orbit. Now, over five decades later, this relic is making an unexpected return and its re-entry path is alarmingly unpredictable. Cosmos 482 was a part of Soviet Union's ambitious Venera program aiming to study Venus. It was launched in March 31, 1972. This spacecraft failed to escape the Earth's orbit due to a premature engine cutoff. As a result, it was designated Cosmos to mask the mission's failure. As of May 2025, the descent module of Cosmos 482, whose weight is approximately 500 kg, is expected to re-enter Earth's atmosphere between May 9 to May 11. Its orbital inclination of 52 degrees means it could land anywhere between 52 north and 52 south latitude, covering a vast portion of the globe. This spacecraft was designed to withstand the extreme conditions of Venus. The descent module's robust construction increases the likelihood of surviving re-entry. While the risk to human life is minimal, the unpredictability of its landing spot has raised concerns among experts. This isn't the first time Cosmos 482 has made headlines. In 1972, parts of the spacecraft landed in New Zealand, causing minor damages but no injuries. The upcoming re-entry serves as a reminder of the long-term implications of space missions and the importance of tracking space debris. Agencies worldwide, including NASA and the European Space Agency, are closely monitoring Cosmos 482's trajectory. Advanced tracking systems aim to provide timely updates, but the exact re-entry point will remain uncertain until the final hours. Cosmos 482's return highlights the growing issues of space debris and the need of sustainable practices in space exploration. As we venture further into the cosmos, ensuring the safe disposal of deep functional spacecraft becomes increasingly critical. While the chances of Cosmos 482 causing harm are low, its re-entry is a significant event in space history. Now if you found this video informative, please subscribe the channel and I'll keep you updated and let's meet in the next video.